Bitch! We need help here! This is really getting ridiculous. I wonder what locked door they're talking about. Ooh, there's the rocket launcher. Hmm. Oh, and by the way, I suppose I should also point out that, um, <laughs> one conversation that I had to miss there out in the, I don't know, the, uh, the yard out there was regarding the rocket launcher. <laughs> and guys were making, uh, you know, cute comments about the rocket launcher. I wonder what locked door that was about. Hmm. Anyway, so I can take those two. Well, I want to have have to make some decisions here, though. I guess. Hmm. Crud. Hmm. <laughs> I guess first of all Drop all those. And hopefully none of them disappear, which, by the way, that has been a problem where things are kind of falling through the graphics. Um, all right, so that didn't. I was wondering where my stun gun went. <laughs> Um, but anyway, oh, whoops, okay, well, alrighty, hmm, all right, so they both, uh, that well, okay. I guess we will. Hmm. Okay, I guess we'll do a little running around here. Since shotguns are worth, uh, hmm. 750 credits, although, you know, I just, I just wasted one of that, <laughs> unfortunately. Uh, 
Oh, why not? Whoops. Uh, okay. I know where it's at. It turned around in here. <laughs> So now that little part is done, uh, and I believe that is really all of it. <laughs> you know, as soon as I go back and sell this shotgun that I don't need. Oops. I must say, I don't know if the frag grenades would actually move the, uh... Um... Like the dumpsters or something of that nature. But, it's kind of nice that they, uh, they put it in there that they will actually blow up the... Um... The wooden crates. Even if you can't move them physically. But I don't know if they would you know, actually jog the, um, you know, like the, the metal dumpsters or say like a vending machine, something like that. I don't know if they knock it out of the this way. This is what I got. I'm a friend of Greg Thorpe. Really? Okay, I give you the egghead discount. <sighs> yeah. And why they do this every time, who knows? It's pretty stupid, really, but... So, we can, uh, sell that, but we certainly don't want to sell the rocket launcher. <laughs> Um done. And if you're wondering by the way why I I keep the one shotgun and I've gone ahead and um put some weapon mods on it already and stuff. I mean, uh, I think I mentioned this before. But basically, it's uh, because I know there's boss fights in this game. And, you know, even though I'm trying to play non-lethal and all that as much as possible, uh, the fact is that there's boss fights in this game. <laughs> so I can't play purely unlethal, which is one of the complaints about the game, by the way, <laughs> for many people. Because it sort of, you know, basically it, it violates how if you're playing that, that type of role for Adam, it violates it. But this rocket launcher, is, <laughs> okay, yeah, right. I was looking at how much inventory space it takes. <laughs> A little crazy. You know, it doesn't look that big when you're just looking at it. But anyway. Um, so back we go. So now that that's over, uh, I'll go collect my stuff again, come back here. Oops. And we can uh, go to my apartment. Oh, yeah. Except. Alright, there is one other thing I do have to check. Just to make sure that I got them. You remember I said that I thought that I maybe had left a couple guns behind. Uh, I have to check the... Uh, the weapons. Okay, I 
attache over here. Make sure I grabbed him. <laughs> I'm not sure I did. Nope, I didn't. Okay. Uh, time to grab him. <laughs> so sorry about that, folks. So I was almost ready to go on. <laughs> but not quite. But yeah, you can pretty well see that I think there's some justification for being a little fed up with the inventory. I'm not sure. I mean, something like the rocket launcher or the sniper rifle, unless you have a very specific use for it, they're making it very, very hard for you to be carrying it around. Which almost makes the weapon useless. Some people already have complained about that with the sniper rifle. I mean, I've kept it a long, you know, kept, kept it just in case, but I'm not really sure it's going to be able to stay with me. I certainly can't carry it with me, and I have a feeling the game's probably going to go ahead and delete it if I leave it here <sighs> when I go to the next area. So, I'm not sure exactly what's going on with that. The other thing I want to want to point out is, you know, I don't really think that you're actually supposed to deactivate. This is what I got. <laughs> really? Uh, anyway, uh, that antenna, like I did, until later. But that's too bad because I already did it, so I don't care. <laughs> but um, yeah, it will be interesting to see what happens because of that, if anything happens because of that. Done. Uh, because I think it may be a little bit out of order. Or it could be totally out of order. I don't really know. I mean, obviously you can do it if you find it, like I did. And, uh, you know, they even have the secretaries with the code on it. So, um, it's not impossible. But I just wonder if maybe it's out of order. Uh... If maybe, you know, something is revealed later on. And that logically that would be when you actually do it. Okay, so the rocket's here. That's nice, but unless I'm actually using the rocket launcher, I don't actually need them. So I might just as well leave them there. Uh... Oops. Ugh, I just turned the wrong one. 